Hello fellow mutants, welcome back to another video. In this video, we're going to talk about how Hayden Christensen feels indebted to Dave Filoni. So let's actually give this a read, shall we? Uh, Hayden Christensen was recently interviewed by Esquire. Naturally, his Star Wars career is covered extensively. From being cast in, in the prequels to his recent return to Obi-Wan Kenobi. However, what caught my eye was Christensen's had to say about the Clone Wars and handling of Anakin Skywalker. I love the Clone Wars. I think what uh, what Dave Filoni did with the Clone Wars and Rebels are brilliant. I'm indebted to Filoni because I think he helped the character of Anakin a lot. I think he fleshed out the character and also furthered out understanding of the relationship with the Jedi and the Council and the mistrust that he had harbored. I think the franchise is in good hands right now, and what John Favreau and Dave Filoni are doing are brilliant. And as a, and so as a fan, I'm very happy to see it expand. I remember Christensen rewatch uh, of the franchise with, was publicized to the lead up of Kenobi. By contrast, Ian McGregor will only rewatch the films, not the spin-off shows. And it, it's awesome that. Hayden caught up on what his character had been up to without him. As he says, Star Wars animation, especially the Clone Wars, did a lot for the character of Anakin. I did. Didn't like the Kenobi series, and I don't blame Christensen or his performance. I enjoyed um uh the Clone Wars, and I have to agree with um Hayden Christensen about how like I think what um, they did with Anakin and all the characters involved that were introduced in the prequels and how they fleshed those characters out a bit were great. I felt like they could have potentially helped Jar Jar a tad bit more, but that's just me. Because I don't hate the character, nor do I have like a, oh my god, I gotta see more of Jar Jar. But I think the few, they could have had Jar Jar a few more episodes to fleshed them out a bit. That's just me. But that's only if they had like more more than one like seven seasons. But um, yeah, the Clone Wars is like one of the best things ever. I remember like the Clone Wars was the first Star Wars movie I've seen in theaters. Technically, the Clone Wars was, was the first Star Wars series I've seen that came out that was new, even back in the Cartoon Network days. And oh my lord, if you guys have not watched the Clone Wars, you guys should. And especially if you guys have any criticism towards, um, like how like hit like has any issues with Anakin, Obi Wan, um, or like any of the characters that were portrayed in those prequels, you guys should watch the Clone Wars because it definitely fleshed them out. Oh, of course, they also get Ahsoka too, so that's cool. But um. Yeah, no, I have to agree with Hayden Christensen that I enjoyed where, how, like, they took Anakin and had his relationship with not only the Jedi, but the Council, and took us to the journey of how, like, there are were seeds of the dark side planting in him, and how, like, those seeds sprouted a bit throughout the war. That was cool. I enjoyed that. I can respect that. But, what do you beautiful people think? Let me know in the comment section down below. And... Who is your fairy's Clone Wars character? Let me know in the comment section down below. Have a wonderful day. Be kind one another. May the forest be with us all.